Hello, Paulie from EMD Automotive at Kamiba, Sydney. Uh, this is the extra Mercedes Benz I was working on before. Um, just want to put the new pump in, but I didn't want to actually start the car before I do this. I need what I've done is remove this uh, relay holder, relay holder here, and then because this thing was burnt before the relay was burnt yesterday. Uh, cutting out uh, the smoke coming out of this because I put a new relay in there and the, all of a sudden the whole thing was smoking up so I need to actually test to make sure there's no short circuit and sometimes the old pump can damage this and I don't want to put this back uh, I don't want to put the new pump in the brand new pump that I just put in and that actually caused it to to play up, play up again and burn because they are expensive so the extra step I have to do is be precaution be just in case the relay for the airmatic uh, pump, air compressor is G, and as you can see, I've got all my stuff in here. Um, what I found is that real, uh, pin 87 on MR2, sorry, uh, 87A, 87A is MR, MR3, pin 3, which is that one there. MR3 is that one there, pin 3 is that one there. See? That one there. <clears throat> so that one got burned from before. That's why I was. Um, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to run a uh, connector wire from the pin itself straight to here um, on top there. Alright, <clears throat> so that way you don't have to buy a brand new one of these. Um, you can buy a brand new one if you want to, but you can actually just repair it. Um, Alright, thanks for watching and please subscribe.